Must be close to a dozen cameras. Seems everybody wants to hear every word from Coach Fulmer. Very busy. Very, very busy. Nice being number one, but it doesn't bode well for free time. The Tennessee Vols are in demand like never before. The Sports Information Department has to set up 119 separate interviews this afternoon. Roughly 40 reporters want to talk, and this is the day only for the local media. This is the first time where we've had a crack at the national title, and that has really probably doubled the attention that we're getting. Most national interviews are done on Wednesdays. All those national folks are regular fixtures around the Tennessee football team this year. Well, Sports Illustrated has been covering the football games for Tennessee each of the last few weeks. USA Today's had people here. There have been national writers at various times that have come here, more so than they have been in the past. And, and I say that because even when Peyton Manning was here, they would, they would come in at, at different times, but it's been more consistent late in the What's a reporter to do? Wait three hours to talk to just a handful of players. One solution is network affiliates double up. Bob will interview players while Chattanooga and Nashville's NBC stations shoot at the same time. All the print people will interview Coach Fulmer at once, and all the TV folks do the same. What do you do when there's this many people around? Can you even get a question in? Yeah, if you wait you know, long enough and there's a specific thing, most everybody's asking the same question, so you don't really worry about, uh, you know, you, you kind of got in your mind which ones you want to ask and you click them off and there's one thing he hadn't touched on, then you go ahead and fire.